Hello, everybody. Or maybe nobody. I don't know if anyone will actually watch this. I guess we'll see. Uh, this is Peter Popoff. Uh, I think if you're probably, if you're watching this, you probably already know who Peter Popoff is. But in case you're new to this, uh, Peter Popoff is a longtime uh, televangelist and faith healer and self-proclaimed reverend who uh, has been around. He's been around forever. He's been around since, I think, the 1970s. Uh, but he reached a peak of popularity in the 80s uh, with his national faith healing tours and claimed to be able to bring people uh, divine wealth and and uh, supernatural healing and knew everything about the people he was meeting in these huge, huge services he would do across the country. Um, as you can probably imagine, he was exposed as a fraud uh, <laughs> multiple times. Uh, the first time by the... Uh, the magician uh, James Randi, who um, found out he was using an earpiece to um, get uh, information from his wife about the people who he claimed to be healing and, and bringing wealth to. Um, and then he went bankrupt after that. He actually went bankrupt and um, kind of fell off the map for a while. But then in the 90s, uh, he made a comeback. He uh, he started buying airtime on a number of uh, different channels across the country, including uh, most notably BET, um, and has really repositioned himself as a uh, you know a, a faith healer once again, but especially for a black audience, for uh, for um, African American residents. And if you watch his uh, his infomercials now, they're uh, definitely targeting uh, that that demographic. Um, he is a scumbag. I don't really know what else to say other than that. We're gonna we're gonna I'm gonna show you why. But uh, he is a scumbag. He's uh, probably one of the most um, nefarious of of all the faith healers, and there have been many over the years. Um, Robert Tilton, Creflo Dollar, just to name a few. Mike Murdoch. There, there are there are many uh, of of these really exploitive figures who are just who are really uh, preying upon people's weaknesses, preying upon their faith, preying upon their desperation, their sickness, their gullibility, um, just to to uh, uh, bring wealth to themselves and their families. And they do this all in the name of religion, and that's how they're able to get away with it. If it weren't for uh, their use of hiding behind religion, they'd uh, they'd never be able to get away with this. It, it would be considered fraud. But um, because you know they they wrap themselves in the in the cloth and call themselves you know men of God, this is not only legal but it's tax free. It's tax free. The money they get is tax free. And and uh, Peter Popoff is probably maybe the most uh, nefarious example of of the. The problem that still exists with faith healers. <clears throat> so what you're looking at now is not only a picture of Peter Popoff, but this is actually his website. And oh, by the way, this is this is Annabelle. She's gonna be appearing from time to time. Hi. This is his website right here, uh, Peter Popoff Ministries. And uh, there's uh, there he is with his wife who uh, was the one who was, by the way, giving him the information in his, in his earpiece when he was busted all those years ago on the, on the Johnny Carson show uh, back in the 80s. And, um, yeah, you can see a little bit of what he says here, you know, about that, uh, you know, that he can bring you out of sickness and lack and discouragement and fear. Um, and it's all in the name of God. He, he you know, obviously he talks a lot of different uh, quotes, a lot of biblical passages, and so on and so forth. And he uses, a, a, a lot of these faith healers will usually, when they uh, reach out to you, a lot of them will, will use the mail uh, to, to mailing lists, and we'll get to that a little later. But they will send you some kind of doodad or trinket or, or some other thing that's anointed or blessed or whatever, and claim that, you know, through that, they'll be able to, that'll be bring you some kind of, you know, divine healing or God's favor or whatever. And of course, eventually they ask you for money. That, that's, that inevitably happens. But, uh, yeah, the, the, the big one that, that, um, Peter Popoff has latched onto in recent years is his miracle spring water. Let's see if I have that here. This is, uh, this right here is one of his, uh, telecasts. 
Um, and he's got a whole, I don't think it's him actually, but he's got a whole, U, there's a whole YouTube channel um, which has uh, hundreds, or not, maybe not hundreds, but dozens and dozens of these, um, of these different telecasts that he does. Most of them are from the, uh, around 2011, 2012, 2013. And uh, many of them are, are very similar to each other, but um, they, I'll just show you a little brief example of them here. I'm Peter Popoff. This is my precious wife, Elizabeth. And we have just literally crisscrossed the United States and the world and seen some of the most amazing miracles. People have been delivered from cancer, from drug habits. By the way, if you can, watch this with the closed captioning on. It is very much worth it just for the comedic value. 30, 40 year drug had isn't it amazing Liz yes. and I have seen more crippled joints loosed people on canes and walkers and crutches delivered and set free and just doing amazing things and this has just happened in the last few weeks do you remember in Newark New Jersey that man had had prayed for a Christian wife and then he got a Christian wife and his green card all in the same week. I remember that. He was rejoicing. He brought his green card. It and was, his wife. And his wife. And they were rejoicing. Well, you're going to witness this. God is doing miracles as people use the miracle spring water and as they use the amazing faith tool to see their debts erased. You get the idea. That's it goes on, and he it, it eventually. Uh, I'll show you. You probably have seen this already. I'll show you some of the service, maybe in another video where he uh, he uh, actually is still, you know, talking to people and saying he touch, you know, touches their heads or whatever, and says, "I have healed you," and you know, I you are uh, you're going to have your debts supernaturally canceled, and you're going to have divine transfers of money. And they have people actually come and give testimonies about how they, you know, they their cancer disappeared, or their uh, someone actually said their HIV disappeared because they used his miracle spring water. Um, people, all the a lot of these people claim to get checks that they never say where they come from, but they get they say I got a check in the mail, or I was at the post office and I found a check for twenty thousand dollars or whatever. It's incredible. It's incredible. The uh, the the length that this guy continues to go to after all these years and it's 2020 now that we're filming this still out there still on television still peddling the same bullshit to people so um we are gonna go back to his website for a minute because well that's not it hold on all right there it is because on his website, um, you can go, you click on Miracle Spring Water, and this is where I guess you can send away for it. And you can fill in a whole, uh, the whole section here. This is, you know, if you want to get your Miracle Spring Water and be, you know, divinely healed or, or come into supernatural abundance, this is how you do it. And uh, then you fill in the prayer needs section. And just to be uh, completely forthcoming here, I have actually joined Peter Popoff's mailing list. There, I've gotten three letters so far. Three letters, and it's only been about two weeks. I've gotten three already. And um, I got the Miracle Spring Water. So I filled out all this crap here uh, with my information um, just to kind of see what kind of what he'd be sending me. And of course, it's very much in the same vein as all the, the nonsense he they're showing here in his his telecast. Um, prayer needs. It says, yeah, fill out your prayer needs. I, I filled out that I was dealing with depression. I'm not currently, but in the past I have um, dealt with some mild depression. Um, uh, I found the, the the cure for my depression. Uh, it was called divorce, <laughs> but um, uh, but you know, but some people they have genuine problems that they're going to write in this spot, like health issues or money issues or or uh, or issues serious uh, current issues with depression. And they're looking for someone, anyone to help them heal, help them find some kind of 
uh, uh, s solution to their problems. And they have a faith in God. And that is uh, usually an admirable thing. But when you put your faith in the hands of someone like Peter Popoff, it, it's so dangerous the, the, um, the length this guy will go to exploit you and take your money. Uh, and he doesn't even have to tell you where it's going. Um, I think it was like 10 years ago, something like that, 10, 12 years ago, he brought in, it was well over $20 million. And he and his wife both got a, a million dollars in salary. His children got uh, close to $200,000 each in salary. Um, and there's really no way of knowing where this money is going to. Um, it's scary. It's scary. But he's, he's still out there. And um, we're going to take a look in the next video at the, not only the Miracle Spring Water and all the other crap that he sent me, but we're also going to take a look at, uh, we're going to do a little beta test. We're going to have a little fun with the Miracle Spring Water and, he, and some, other, some of this other shit and, uh, and see how it works. So, um, yeah, the next video, you can uh, check that out. Thanks.